So now I'm standing at our entrance looking out towards the road. As you can see our entrance is on a corner here on 2650. And if you notice, going back to the east, it's up a hill. Water drains from that hill down to here. And similarly, it's up a big hill uh, going north, more or less north. And what happened is, when the county came out here and paved this road, they did two things. The first mistake is a there was a culvert here that they've now reopened, but when they paved this road, they covered this culvert over so it didn't drain. And that culvert drains right over here to the bar ditch that's been here forever and was never washed. And then they fixed it up some more here. But they, by filling up that culvert, the water basically just collected here in this corner. And it's like a big dam. And the second thing they did is, if you look on this, this, on this, this side of the road, the low point on this side of the road used to be right here where I'm standing so that when the water backed up in this corner, it drained right into this ditch. Been that way for 25 years, never had a problem. But now, this is no longer the low point on this road. The low point, and we ran a level out here to understand where, what the level the low point was. The low point is now, uh, right here, if you can actually you can maybe see the paint that we've marked it with. And so now that funneled all the water right through our gate around the corner and has done all this damage. Uh, so my understanding, if somebody uh, diverts water onto your property and it does damage, they're responsible for it. We've been trying to talk to the county and they're not responding, so we're looking for help. Thank you.